Hi guys, congrats on completing your subscription to Sale Freak's auto order plan. In this tutorial, we will go through the four steps of connecting your Amazon account to Sale Freaks. You will learn how to enter your Amazon credentials, connect your Gmail account, verify your Amazon account is connected, and enter your Amazon gift card balance. Now you can go ahead and connect your Amazon account in order to initiate the auto order function which will automatically fulfill eBay orders by purchasing your items from Amazon as long as you have a gift card balance. Alternatively, some of you have a Prime Business account, which can also integrate your credit card if you choose to do so. However, we will focus now on setting up the auto order with gift cards. Your first step will be to insert your email and password in the auto pop-up box that automatically appears after you purchase your subscription. You will also see an option to redirect to Gmail and accept integrations with SaleFreaks. The Gmail address you use must be attached to your Amazon account. You will want to choose this option if you would like the system to automatically update your tracking information on eBay. We recommend this integration to fully take advantage of the automation SaleFreaks has to offer. If you do not have a Google email address, you can easily create one for free and link it to your Amazon account. Once you are finished, click OK. You will then be redirected to choose your Google account. If you have more than one Google account, remember to select the account associated with your Amazon account. You will then be redirected to the My Accounts page of Sale Freaks automatically. Your second step would be to access your Amazon account from our system and what we call Safe Access. Safe Access is a virtual server we set up in order to establish the connection between our system and your account. You will see your Amazon connection under Accounts. Click the Amazon logo to verify access. Once you allow access, you will see that your details will be inserted automatically. This is how our system logs into your Amazon account every time in order to fulfill an order. The next step is to have a one-time only verification code sent to your email account to verify your identity. Click Send Code and then go to your email account to get the verification code. You will copy the code and then add it to the clipboard and paste. The regular copy and paste will not work in this area, so make sure you use the clipboard or manually type the code in. You will then see the Amazon homepage. You will want to copy down your Amazon gift card balance because you will use it in the next step. If you do not have a balance on your Amazon account, please update it to make the automation work. You can now close the tab and go back to the My Accounts page. Towards the bottom of the page, under Edit Column, you will need to click the Edit icon. Under the status, you will want to choose Prime, and then you will want to add the balance of your Amazon gift cards that you have written down. When you are done, click Update. You will see the correct balance in the Balance column and under your Amazon Prime link. You can also hover over your username towards the top of the page and see the updated Prime balance there. You will now be able to log in and fulfill your orders. Please note that if you have more than one address stored on your Amazon account, the system will not be able to fulfill orders automatically, so please go to your address book and delete them apart from the default address. If you are encountering issues, please go to Orders, Purchase Issues to contact your chat. Congratulations, you have now set up your auto order function and are good to go.